Hey, what's up everybody? This is Titan from Titans of CNC. And this is Travis, my shop supervisor. Hey, so today we're gonna talk to you guys a little bit about lasers. I've been in this game for a long time and I've gone through all different types of processes for easily marking parts. A lot of the engineers at these top aerospace companies, they started asking me, hey Titan, we want you to laser our parts. I didn't have a laser. I didn't know anything about the whole application, the process, I didn't know anything. So I started doing research because I could see that the industry was changing. Now, instead of asking me, the engineers were actually putting it into the notes that you had to laser the parts. So now it's a required process. So I'm like, if this is the world I'm gonna live in, I better get myself a laser. I looked at all kinds of different lasers. So I found out the exact laser that I needed. They could do plastic, it could do aluminum, it could do titanium, it could do titanium and ink canal that was actually coated. It actually had the strength to laser into any material. And then I found Beamer Laser. I saw that there were a lot of laser companies. They were so-called American made, but I found out that they only assembled their products in America. Most of the products were made in other countries through outsourcing. Beamer makes their parts in the USA, they assemble them in the USA, and it's an amazing machine. I asked my boy Travis to step up in front of the camera to show you guys how easy the process is. So Travis, we have the Academy part. Yeah. It's the binocular. Yep, You yes, wanna sir. show these guys how it's done? Yeah, absolutely. Cool. All right, so we have our part. Here's the Academy part. Um, we have the Beamer laser system. We do absolutely love this system. As Titan has mentioned, saves us both time and money. It's really nice just to do things in-house. So up here we have our screen, and you have a lot of options. You can go ahead and type in basically your own part number you like right here. You can import files if you like. You can do uh, barcodes, QR codes. There's actually a lot of versatility to the machine. Here we got a pretty simple uh, font right here. Typed it in, we put a nice little radius on it to outline the binoculars right here. It's basically set up to go. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and put it in the machine and show you how we laser it. So Travis, how do you make sure that everything that you wrote right here on the screen projects perfectly onto the part? That's actually a great question because you don't want to laser your part wrong. So what we'll do is we'll set up a little fixture in there to basically align our part uh, the same way each time. They have a nice little function here where you can preview the laser and you'll start a pointer and you can basically look at an outline of the laser before you laser it so you know exactly where that laser is going to go. So it just projects it right there, boom. Exactly, it'll project it right across the surface where you're going to laser. Is it red just like the letters? It'll be red just like the letters. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so you want to show us? Yeah, so it's ready to go. So you can see our fixture in there. We just got two, one, two, three blocks. All right, this allows for consistent fixturing. So now it's lined up. So he basically just put a one, two, three block here, one, two, three block. He created a stop and he just takes the part, and puts it right there. We're using one, two, three blocks today, but if this is a repetitive part, you probably want to use something a little bit heavier just so you can just move the material quickly and not worry about it being bumped. There's no pressure on the part. All you have to do is make sure the part repeats and goes in place perfectly. Ty, you want to see this thing laser? Absolutely, man, let's do this. All right, let's do it. We'll close the door for safety's sake. Here we go. Is that it? That's it. What was that? That was like five, ten seconds. Boom. And there you go. You can see the marking going all the way around the diameter, absolutely perfect. So this is aluminum. The settings right now on aluminum, is it the same as titanium if you're actually lasering titanium? No, it is not. We actually have quite a few options with respect to lasering different types of materials. So if we were to do something like titanium or Inconel, we'd change the settings, easily accessible right here through the control panel. All right, there you go. Beamer Laser Systems, proudly made right in Michigan. Marking our parts absolutely perfect. Ralph, thank you, brother. Oh, no problem. Thank uh, you. Always. All right, back to machining.